Hey guys, welcome to my short video walk around of my GS750 Suzuki Cafe Racer. I might start it up as well. Um, I've had this bike for about seven years, seven or eight years. I built it with my, my late father. Um, and it's, oh, it's just a, it's a lovely machine. It's a, a really pretty looking bike, I think. Um, it's built with that sort of Cafe Racer feel inspired by bikes of the of the 60s. It's, uh, it's got a few nice little features on it. Um, starting with the engine, I suppose it's a A50 big ball kit, Wiseco pistons. I think the cams might be a little hotter than standard. The Makunis have been off for a rebuild. Um, I haven't put the, the gauzes back on yet. I wouldn't normally run it flawless. Um, and uh, Vance and Hines system. It's got the, the uh, under here. Um, if I can just show you that, maybe if I can lift it up. Um, we've got, you know, Dyna 2000 ignition system. Really tiny little, uh, Lithium battery. It all really fits quite quite neatly under that uh, uh, cover. I think that's a Vonzetti um, tailpiece. The only wires you see are really sort of as it comes underneath there. Um, that's obviously for my charger. Um, it's got the integral tail lights and indicators. Hagon shocks. Uh, probably one of my favourite parts of this bike is the brakes, the, uh, the brake calipers. So these are these are made by Harrison Billet. Um, see on the keyring there, billet.co.uk. Absolutely beautiful bits of kit, really nice. And uh, same on the back with a sort of custom. I think they made that that, that custom bracket for me as well to my spec. Um, and the second favourite thing about this bike are the wheels. They're um, Akron, I think Hagon built um, racing wheels. I got them off eBay um, when I was building the bike, so it's a long time ago now. It's an 18 on the rear and a 19 on the front. And uh, I mean, they just look beautiful. Um, so many little details on this bike that I keep, I, I forget. Um, these end caps are, are new. Uh, put them on there the other day. We got there. Yeah, we got. I would like to get some better clocks for it. Maybe some nice Smith gauges or something. These are a bit. These are a bit cheap. These ones, but even like you know these these end caps. There's some companies out there that, that do these beautiful stainless steel parts, and um, the quality of them is absolutely fantastic. This is a, a period. Uh, sort of cross piece uh, fork brace, I think it's called. Uh, they're the original forks. I would like to, I would like to put maybe a different front end on it at some point, maybe a GSXR. Um, maybe some custom yokes and some, some beefier forks. Maybe a, even a, something like a, I think they're called match tech or uh, swing arm, polished swing arm would be quite nice. So that's it really. Um, that's the walk around. Uh, I guess let's see if it's let's see if it starts up. This might be. Uh, let's reach in there and put the uh, put the choke on. The ignition. Got the lights on. Um, let's see if it fires up. It might need a.